The most advanced Allied Air Force now had an operational fleet of fourth-generation fighters, defined by attributes such as fly-by-wire, highly unstable, highly agile, net-centric, multi-weapon and multi-role assets. These Western types include the Boeing F-A-18E-F Super Hornet, Dassault Rafale, Eurofighter Typhoon and Saab Gripen NG. The Boeing F-15E and Lockheed Martin F-16 have older legacies, but recent upgrades give them similar multi-role mission capabilities. It is only the Super Hornet and Rafale M that are capable of carrying out carrier operations. As the fighter's weapons, sensor systems and net-centric capabilities mature, the possibility of export orders becomes much more realistic. On behalf of Flight International, several were the first British test pilots to evaluate the Rafale in the current F-3 production standard, which applies to aircraft for frontline squadrons of the French Air Force and Navy. Rafale components and fuselage sections are built at various Dassault facilities across France and assembled near Bordeaux, but maintained in a lockstep design and engineering configuration using virtual reality. Dassault's patented Cotnia database is also used on the company's Falcon 7X business jet. Rafale software upgrades are scheduled every two years, a full set of new generation sensors is planned for 2012 and a full upgrade is planned for 2020. The Rafale was always designed as an aircraft capable of carrying out air-to-ground, reconnaissance or nuclear strike missions, while maintaining outstanding air-to-air -air performance and capabilities. For example, the Air Force and Navy have made three full operational deployments to Afghanistan since 2005, giving French forces unrivaled combat and logistical experience. The commitment has also proven the aircraft's net-centric capabilities and the coordination required by coalition air forces and command and control environments when providing air support services to ground forces. Six Rafale M's recently conducted a major joint exercise with the U.S. Navy from the deck of the Nimitz-class aircraft carrier USS Theodore Roosevelt. <laughs>